Okay, let's look at another problem. Assume you have a random variable x that is normally distributed with a mean of 78 and a standard deviation of 5. Find the probability that x is less than 76. Okay, let's change our values. Let's see, what was it? A mean of 78, a standard deviation of 5. Now these are left over, so I'm going to go down here and backspace, get rid of that, and get rid of this, get rid of this. I'm only entering things in those many colored green, many green boxes. So 78, 5. What is the probability? that uh, x is less than 76. Less than 76 is jello, or probability to the left, so we were using this one, less than 76. Boom! The probability is 0.3446. Honest to goodness, we just nailed that in about two seconds, three seconds. Same situation, a mean of 78 and a standard deviation of 5. Find the probability that x is greater than 75. We're going to bring out the magic calculator. Okay, the probability that it's greater than 75 means the probability is to the right greater than 75. I put a 75 in here, hit the end. 0.7257. Nailed it. Could you please give me a tougher one? Oh, same situation. What's the probability that it's between 75 and 81? Oh, we can do this, can't we? Surely we can. Between 75 and 81. So it's a between. So I'm going to use this one. 75, 81. Hit the enter button. Boom! 0.4515. Now, this is where it is very important that you understand this is a continuous distribution. It's greater than 75, less than 81. We're not worried about, well, is it 76? Or, you're not, because with a continuous distribution, it's like weights or like, you know, uh, anything greater than 75. So we're using those actual endpoints, 75 and 81, with a continuous distribution. 75.000001 would be greater than 75. So we don't have to worry about, well, is it a less than or a less than and or equal to? You don't have to worry about that with a normal distribution. So we nailed all three. Again, I must ask you to go outside and yell, bazinga, 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 because we nailed it. Let's work another one in our next video.